Like catching a frog, it can be hard to follow on perfection. Oh, wow. But the best chance to find a platforming experience that can surpass Rayman 2 would be from the joint free buddy himself in Rayman 3. I had to catch it. The game is once again a platformer that focuses on action with fast jumping and combat rather than freeform exploration and puzzle solving. This time around, bad types have derived newfound power from prune juice, and Rayman's buddy Globix has himself developed a taste for the elixir. The beverage is behind an array of nasty enemies called hoodlums that must be dispatched. I know, it doesn't make sense. They're French. The elegant controls will be instantly familiar to anyone that played any version of Rayman 2. Some new additions are power-ups that grant Rayman blue metallic action clamps and a lawsuit inviting cap that provides helicopter action. All of these skills, though, are temporary. Most important to a new Rayman game is the design, and it's already clear that the third installment will once again be a visual treat. As before, the art direction establishes a wholly unique world with an odd touch of menace that no one can dismiss as just for kids. As you can see, this can easily get one's fingers twitching. But we're going to have to all wait and see how it comes together when it's released spring 2003.